ectopic pregnancy. What's that? The word ectopic means in an abnormal position or in an abnormal place. Ectopic pregnancy is the pregnancy that occurs when a fetus develops and continue to grow in an abnormal position or in an abnormal place inside female body. We know that fertilization occurs when the fusion between the sperm and the ovum takes place inside the fallopian tube of female reproductive system in human. Now, this fertilized egg starts to grow fast and divides into many cells. It leaves the fallopian tube and enters inside the uterus or womb approximately 3 to 4 days after fertilization and after some time it must implant in the lining of the uterus or in the endometrium for further development of embryo and over the time for the development of fetus and this is very important for a normal pregnancy. Ectopic pregnancy occurs when the fertilized egg gets stuck on its way and starts to develop somewhere outside the uterus, typically within the fallopian tube, and the implantation takes place inside this. As a result, the further development of embryo and the development of the fetus take place inside the tube. The luminal cells of the fallopian tube has small hair-like structures on their surface called cilia. And by the ciliary movement of this hair-like structure, a flow is created from the ovary to the uterus. This flow carries the egg from the ovary to the uterus. The reduction in the number of cilia inside the fallopian tube may slow down the transport of the fertilized egg in case of ectopic pregnancy. In this case, the fetus rarely survives longer than a few weeks because the tissues outside the womb or the uterus cannot provide the necessary blood supply and also fails to provide enough space for the growth of it. That's why if it is not diagnosed in time, more or less between 6 and 16 weeks, the fallopian tube will rupture. Fallopian tube is the most common site for the development of ectopic pregnancy. Other less common sites are the ovary, cervix, abdominal cavity. Some common symptoms in an ectopic pregnancy include light to heavy vaginal spotting or bleeding, abdominal pain, pelvic pain, dizziness or fainting, shoulder tip pain, etc. But sometimes ectopic pregnancy may have no sign. How is an ectopic pregnancy diagnosed? A pelvic exam can tell about the size of the uterus. So doctor will likely to do a pelvic exam to check the size of the uterus. A blood test can be a useful way to check the level of pregnancy hormone HCG or human chorionic gonadotropin and this test is repeated again two days later. During early pregnancy, the level of the hormone HCG doubles every two days. Low level of this hormone may be a sign of ectopic pregnancy. Another test is an ultrasound. With the help of an ultrasound, doctor can see a pregnancy in the womb or the uterus six weeks after the last menstrual bleeding. The most common treatment for ectopic pregnancy are medicines and surgery. How does an ectopic pregnancy develop? What are the risk factors? Inflammation of fallopian tube, the use of intrauterine device, pelvic inflammatory disease, previous ectopic pregnancy, previous pelvic or abdominal surgery, endometriosis. All of these factors may cause the development of ectopic pregnancy.